Wash in my swash buckle. were brave and heroic, Skater. In fact, the real Blackbeard wasn't very nice at all. 
His real name was Edward Teach, and he used to attack ships in the Carolinas in Virginia and hurt people. Really? He hurt people? Uh-huh. Until they caught him in 1718, and well... You mean... Uh-huh. Ah. Oh. Wow! What kind of book is this? It's a picture book of world history, Ralph. World history, huh? Looks interesting. Hey, don't hog it, Ralph. Meet pictures. I'll be back later. Enjoy the book. Look at those funny guys. Those are cavemen, Fozzie. Did you say spacemen? Let me see. What are you doing, Gonzo? I'm looking for my favorite period in history. You're going to be history if you don't watch your manners, nitwit. Imagine the size of the aquarium you'd need to keep that lizard. That's not a lizard. It's a dinosaur. A stegosaurus, to be exact. How did you know that, Scooter? Because prehistoric time is my favorite part of history. Think of it. Smoking volcanoes, giant reptiles, bubbling swamps. Ew! This place smells yucky. Uh, creepy looking, too. It's not creepy if you understand it. I'm going to be a paleontologist when I grow up. You're going to study aliens? Not alientologist. Paleontologist. You know, a doctor of philosophy. Oh, I know that. As a paleontologist, I'll study fossils to find out what life was like millions of years ago. Now, Gonzo, why are you still wearing your spacesuit? This isn't the space age, it's the stone age. Just follow me, guys. I know all about these prehistoric swamps. Yo! Hey, who put this hole here? I think he did. Yo! with animals, Piggy. Thank you, Fozzie. Let me try. Give me your paw. Oh, no. I don't know about you, but I think I'd rather have a poodle. I think you're hungry. We feed, we feed. Nice puppy. Oh, no! Animal makes the dinosaurs a puppy! My puppy! without making quite so much noise, okay? Okay, Nanny. It's gotta be in here somewhere. Don't hog the book, Gonzo. Yeah, why not look at it? Look, that's Sir Isaac Newton. He discovered the laws of gravity. Oh, I know how he did that. He was sitting under a tomato tree one day, trying to discover the laws of comedy. Hmm, let's see. A good joke has to have a chicken in it. Oh, I've got one. Why don't chickens lay grapefruits? Because who'd want to eat a grapefruit omelet? Waka, waka, waka! <laughs> hey, I just discovered the law of gravity. What goes up must come down. Wow! 
I think I just discovered the law of comedy, too. If you don't have a good joke, all you need is a ripe tomato. Ah! This part of history is boring. Turn the page, animal. I think we went too far. Oh, us. Skeeter. I, uh, I think it's on the next page. Gonzo, what are you doing? I'm getting ready to fly into space. But this is 1492. No one's gonna go into space for almost 500 years, Gonzo. Ha! That's what you think. We're going into space just as soon as we reach the end of the page. Oh, no! Oh, no! What part of history are we in now? I think it's the part without any pictures. If you like good pictures, you'll love my favorite part of history. I bet it's on the next page. Close, but no cigar. Come on, Gonzo, let us look. Wow, the American Revolution. That's my favorite part of history. Hold this, Fuzzy. Another boat! You got it! Where are we going, Kermit Washington? Um, I don't know, Fozzie. The painting ends here. Science fiction. Uh-uh, not 
source weirdos, it isn't. Ha <laughs> The mysterious Planet X. Get ahead, Space Cadets. Hey, if you ask me, it looks more like a cantaloupe with a bandage on it. Well, it may not look like much from here, Cadet Piggy, but Planet X is one of the wildest, weirdest worlds in the galaxy. Well, I hope it's one of the softest, too, Gonzo, because we're going to crash into it. Huh? Oh, boy! Yeah. Uh, nice landing, Gonzo. Thank you. Gee, our rocket's wrecked. Now how do we get home, Captain Gonzo? Get home? We just got here. Hey, look! The hidden entrance to the secret underground city of Planet X. Come on, you'll love this place. Wait a minute, Gonzo. We don't want to go sightseeing. The alarm. Activate the viewing screen. But, Gonzo, we've got to get our rocket fixed. No problem. I don't believe it. Nothing. Hey, guys, maybe we can find a new rocket. <laughs> Maybe we can find Gonzo a new brain. Piggy. Our next stop, the action-packed underground city of Planet X. Right this way, please. <laughs> well, we got the packed part, right? Yeah, now where's the action? <laughs> Nope. That's fine. Good. Then let's move out, Space Cadets. Let's go find that new rocket ship. Yeah, let's go. Maybe we can figure out how to get home, too. But, but, wait a minute. We don't need a new rocket. We can get the old one fixed. I'll find a, a repair shop. Hmm. Let's see now. Hey, Piggy, without Gonzo, how are we going to find a new rocket? After all, this is his fantasy. Oh, silly. We'll ask someone. Oh, yeah? Who? Um, uh, well, um, uh, him! Whoa, look! He's carrying a little rocket. Um, excuse me, sir. Do you know where we can find a new rocket? Robot, lead them to me. Follow me. Her Imperial Majesty, Queen Teacup. The Queen? Boy, I bet she's gonna buy an expensive rocket. You are trespassers in the secret underground city of Planet X. And as such, you must be punished. But we didn't do anything. Uh, excuse me, Your Queenliness, but um, we didn't mean to come here. See, actually, Miss Queen Lady, we came here to, uh... To make you laugh. Oh, boy. With one of my great jokes. Oh, oh no. no. You really love this one, Your Royal Swankiness. It's a real Lulu. <clears throat> okay, here goes. When is a queen not a queen? Give up? <laughs> when she's a ruler. 
Get it? Queen? Ruler? <laughs> Pretty funny, huh? Silence! Uh -oh. Perhaps ten lashes of the scrubula from the gentle Lord Argo will improve the fuzzy one's sense of humor. No! Not the scrabula! Anything but the scrabula! Not that! Uh, uh, well, wait a minute. What is a scrabula anyway? Wait a minute, Queenie. If if you do that to Fozzie, then then you have to do that to all of us. I beg your pardon? Speak for yourself, Kermit. Very well, then. Have it your way. Lord Argo locks them up in our deepest, darkest dungeon while we decide their fate. No, oh, that sounds horrible. Just get them out of my sight. But, but your queenliness. Oh, whatever will we do, Kermit? Well, don't look at me, Piggy. You took over as our captain, remember? <gasps> what? <laughs> hey, it's Gonzo! The most fun you can ever have. Seen animal lately? Bye bye. 